According to Consumer Reports, these are the pickup truck models that ranked lowest in reliability based on results from over 500,000 owners surveyed, along with performance data from previous years. This is a compliment video to the pickup trucks that scored highest in reliability. A link to that video is in the description below. Let's get started. At number 7, the Chevrolet Colorado. When the Colorado reappeared for 2015, owners reported issues with the climate system, suspension, and fuel system. In the following years, some of those problems have lingered, hence Colorado's below average reliability prediction for 2019. For 2017 and 2018, this model was among the very worst pickup trucks for reliability. It only approved slightly according to consumer reports for the coming year. At number 6, the GMC Canyon. As the Chevy Colorado goes, so does the GMC Canyon. This more upscale GM truck also comes off of two years with the poorest reliability ratings a pickup can get. With that recent past, it was almost a given that Consumer Reports would rate it below average for 2019. In the past few years, owners have reported trouble with the transmission, fuel system, and cabin electronics, but that's only naming issues that were widespread. If you check on Canyon's reliability stats from 2018, you'll find trouble in nearly all of the 17 areas considered in the Consumer Reports survey. At number five, the Nissan Titan. After its 2017 redesign, the Titan got solid road test scores from Consumer Reports testers. However, this model never inspired confidence on the reliability front. Problem areas included auxiliary engine components, belts, pulleys, mounts, and body integrity, leaks, and cracks. These issues kept Titan down among the worst pickups following the latest survey. On a scale of 1 to 100, Titan's predicted reliability for 2019 was 28%. Stacked against the competition, that puts Nissan's truck well behind Ford and Ram 2500 models and completely out of Toyota Tundra's league. At number four, the Toyota Tacoma. As this compact pickup from the industry's most reliable mainstream brand, Tacoma should be a safe bet for 2019. However, Consumer Reports surveys revealed multiple problems since the 2016 redesign. Now in its fourth year, Tacoma landed its second consecutive below average rating after two years among the worst small pickups. Among the issues reported, transmission trouble might be the most worrisome for truck buyers. Rough shifting and a slipping transmission fall under this category. Meanwhile, drivetrain issues were also noteworthy. At number three, the Chevrolet Silverado 2500 HD. When you land among the vehicles ranked worst for reliability, it's officially a bad year. And that's where the Chevy Silverado 2500 HD found itself following the 2019 survey. Problems turned up everywhere. At the risk of simplifying what is a long list, let's just say fuel system and body integrity issues prompted the most negative feedback from owners. Meanwhile, transmission and drivetrain issues should also not be ignored. At number two, the GMC Sierra 2500 HD. As the GMC counterpart to the Silverado, the Sierra 2500 HD shares the strengths and weaknesses of its counterpart. Owners have reported a number of issues with these models in recent years, among them trouble with the fuel system, minor transmission components, and body integrity stand out. The latest poor predicted reliability rating from Consumer Reports makes four straight years for the Sierra 2500 HD. Overall, its score, 16%, was one of the year's very worst. And the pickup truck with the worst reliability ratings for 2019, according to Consumer Reports, the Ram 3500. Out of all the cars and trucks on the U.S. market, Consumer Reports named the Ram 3500 the least reliable vehicle you can buy. On the mechanical front, owners reported trouble with the transmission, steering, fuel system, and transmission. As for fit and finish, body integrity represented another sore spot for the Ram 3500. Though this is a powerful truck built solely for work, Consumers may want to consider the other options out there with the same capability. At the very least, you should go into the purchase expecting some trouble and visits to the service center for as long as you own it. Again, to find out the pickup trucks that ranked highest in reliability, check out the link below this video. Until next time, I'm Dave Erickson. Thanks for watching. One more thing before you go, I've added links to some of the best-selling automotive accessories on Amazon right now, along with links to some of my product reviews. You'll find it in the description below this video.